Shemuel Shani, 2 Samuel 6. Again, David gathered together at all the chosen men of Yashadael, 30,000. And David arose and went with all the people that were with him from Baal Li Yahuda to bring up from thence Eth the Ark of Elohim, whose name is called by the name of Yahuwah Savaoth, that dwells between the Karavim. And they set at the Ark of Elohim upon a new cart and brought it out of the house of Avinadav that was in Giva, and Uzzah and Achio, the sons of Avinadav, drove at the new cart. And they brought it out of the house of Avinadav, which was at Giva, accompanying the ark of Elohim. And Achio went before the ark. And David and all the house of Yashrael played before Yahuwah on all manner of instruments made of fir wood, even on harps, and on psalteries, and on timbrels, and on shofars, and on cymbals. And when they came to Nachan's threshing floor, Uzzah put forth his hand to the Ark of Elohim and took hold of it, for the oxen shook it. And the anger of Yahuwah was kindled against Uzzah, and Elohim smote him there for his error. There he died by the ark of Elohim. And David was displeased because Yahuwah had made a breach upon Uzzah, and he called the name of the place Peretz Uzzah to this day. And David was afraid of Eth Yahuwah that day, and said, How shall the ark of Yahuwah come to me? So David would not remove Eth the ark of Yahuwah unto him into the city of David. But David carried it aside into the house of Oved Edom, the Gitti. And the ark of Yahuwah continued in the house of Oved Edom, the Gitti, three months. And Yahuwah blessed Eth Oved Edom and Eth all his household. And it was told King David, saying, Yahuwah has blessed Eth the house of Oved Edom and Eth all that pertains unto him, because of Eth the ark of Elohim. So David went and brought up the Eth ark of Elohim from the house of Oved Edom into the city of David with gladness. And it was so that when they that bore the ark of Yahuwah had gone six paces, he sacrificed oxen and fatlings, and David danced before Yahuwah with all his might, and David was girded with a linen ephod. So David and all the house of Yashrael brought up Eth, Ark of Yahuwah, with shouting, and with the sound of the shofar. And as the Ark of Yahuwah came into the city of David, Michal, Shaul's daughter, looked through a window, and saw Eth King David leaping and dancing before Yahuwah, and she despised him in her heart. And they brought in Eth the ark of Yahuwah, and set it in his place in the midst of the tabernacle that David had pitched for it. And David offered burnt offerings and peace offerings before Yahuwah. And as soon as David had made an end of offering burnt offerings and peace offerings, he blessed the people in the name of Yahuwah Savaoth. And he dealt among all the people, even among the whole multitude of Yashadael, as well to the women and as men, to everyone a cake of bread and a good piece of flesh and a flagon of wine. So all the people departed, everyone to his house. Then David returned Eth to bless his household, and Michal, the daughter of Shaul, came out to meet David and said, How glorious was the king of Yashadael today, who uncovered himself today in the eyes of the handmaids of his servants, as one of the vain fellows shamelessly uncovers himself. And David said unto Michal, 
It was before Yahuwah, which chose me before your father and before all his house, to appoint me ruler over the people of Yahuwah, over Yashara'el. Therefore will I play before Yahuwah, and I will yet be more vile than thus, and will be base in my own sight, and of the maidservants which you have spoken of. Of them shall I be had in honor. Therefore Michal, the daughter of Shaul, had no child unto the day of her death.